Welcome to World Immigration News by Irfan. If anybody wants to settle in Canada and he wants PR of Canada, which is the easiest way by which he can easily go to Canada and also he can try uh, in less time, he can get work permit and in less time he can get the permanent residency. Even the chances, you know, day by day chances of these countries are decreasing, you are listening news, but still there are chances. But if you will use some technical way, mean that some thinking way with the skills you will go and you will follow the advice of your consultant and you will also be careful in your application. So there are chances that still you can get PR if you have specific qualification and the specific skills which is required in Canadian country. So there are many ways. First way is student visa, which I don't favor. Reason is that because uh, fee of student visa is has been increased by the university and there are chances if you are young, uh, this is good if you want to get education. But if you are going for PR and you are using student visa, uh, student visa channel as in this, uh, in this uh, era, in this month, in this year, I will not prefer. Reason is that Canadian capping on student, they are going to stop the students and they just want genuine students in their countries and they are demotivating students to settle in their country. Therefore, my, my clip is already recorded in which now qualification is related with the with the work permit. Mean that the course which we will do in the in the Canada, you will be able to get the work permit on that base and province wise. And it's very difficult to get the status uh, uh, into the PR when you are in the student. So second option which you have the work permit programs, PNP programs, skilled uh, skilled uh, skilled programs, skilled people programs. Sorry, express entry programs. But now currently, you know that if student visa are were most easiest visa of Canada because you are paying something to Canada. When you are paying something to Canada and Canadian country is a is economy 50% of migrants of Australia and the Canada depending upon the students and their fee was giving a, uh, it was going to increase the GDP ratio of Canada. Universities expenses are run by the fee and one student uh, claimed in Canada just months back, just days back, sorry, that we are paying three times more fee than Canadian citizen. So you can imagine that how much fee is now and uh, Australia fee now increased up to one six double zero dollar uh, just application fee the university fee you know that that is huge you have to consume in a, a crore a crore a crore rupees and thousands dollars so this way to get the PR becoming a little a bit uh, difficult now day by day and the uh, gov Canadian government is a uh, just setting a student visa in such a way that only students under under uh, under programs they go they get their study they work even for one year then they go back to their home country they don't settle that's the wish of Canada. Second uh, skill program uh, that's very difficult I think so in the sense easier one but not difficult difficult in the sense time consumption is so much from Asian countries sometime one year you are waiting six months you are waiting and also result is a. Uh, uh, sometimes result is positive, sometimes result is negative. The most uh, pricking uh, uh, point of uh, skill programs uh, applications are that after one year, after 1.5 year, when you will get information, you are not qualified. Your one year or your 1.5 year will be wasted and you will be thinking that uh, uh, that was not better idea to waste the time. The better I should have been trying to any other country. So technically you are in home country, your time is not being consumed. Remember. When you are in any country, you have chance to get the PR. You are understanding. When you are living in that country, for example, you want the permanent residency of United Kingdom. If you are in United Kingdom and paying taxes, you have complete chance to get the PR because uh, after some years, you will hire a lawyer and lawyer will request the Department of Immigration that he was paying taxes. You are very eligible. When you are living in your home country, this 1.5 year which you had applied work permit program, skilled program, you was living in your home country, that time is completely wasted. Even you was not working well in your home country because in your mind was that I have to go to Canada. I, I know many people who are telling since three years I am going to Canada with the family, I am going to Canada. but. They did not go, they are here because their programs, even their professional doctors, they are pharmacists, 
but when it's so long time it's so long time a waiting time that some time uh, application processing of IRCC become very late and the result become negative. When if the result become positive, then it's okay. Then 1.5 year consume, no problem. At least you have success and you have entered Canada. But 1.5 year will not count it which you have waited. In some cases, the processing is less, but most of the cases it exceeds up to one year and sometime more than one year. Huge time is required in processing work permit and skill program application. Yes, one way is there that any company offers you from Canada. Uh, the right way I will tell you in last, I am I'm just going that. Uh, any company offers you job uh, when you are in Asia, any company offers you job, you are a very skilled person. And now how that company will not offer job in Canada, will offer you job. It means you are not an ordinary man and you are more, more than ordinary man, you are extraordinary man. All people are not extraordinary. You are living in home country. You don't know even English well. The people in Canada having a lot of experience qualified from the university. Why they will not prefer? Second one, you will pay money. So then once again, why you will pay the money in crore dollars, in crore money, just if job of job offer. And still you don't know the Canadian embassy will give you a visa or not. Still don't know when you will go to Canada, that company will entertain you or not. So this is also a tricky and risky factor. To give money to get the job offer now i'm telling you the right way in this uh, uh, in this scenario i'm not talking about that uh, after some months uh, after some days if the canadian rules of, of the visas for the students of a work permits change they they became processing faster my stance will also change but in current scenario one of the best option is canada visit visa tourist visa now you will be asking sir we are talking about to settle in canada and you are talking Canada tourist visa. What is the contrast and what is the contradiction? I will tell you. This is the easiest way. No medical, no medical, no uh, no admission in Canada. No wait of 1.5 year student visa is also very long process. You know to do IELTS. You need to fulfill all requirements. You need to admit. You have to submit thousand and thousand of dollar in the accounts of Canada. Still don't know you will get the visa or not. Even you will get the visa, you will study three years and after three years you will get the work permit and then you will be able to get the work permit. You will not be able to get the work permit, nobody knows. And then your PR desti destination start, PR traveling start, never knows. They will give you PR or they will not give you PR because in this status in which uh, you are going as a student, Canadian government and IRCC immigration department is not promoting and they want that you must uh, they want that you must go back to your home country so right way tourist visa in the sense when you will get the tourist visa uh, but how you will get the tourist visa I will discuss later on but, but later on but when you will get the tourist visa when you will enter into Canada what will happen you will uh, switch your tourist visa into the work permit when you will be in a Canada, you have 80% chance. Now, this is the chance I'm talking. You, without wastage of time, within one month, within one month or within less than one month, your application is decided. You will be in Canada. If your this is the point how I will get tourist visa, I will record one another clip. I am starting services of Canadian tourist visa very soon from my office. If you will get tourist visa, you if you add 80 percent chance that you can switch your tourist visa to the work permit and if you will be able to switch your tourist visa to the work permit 100 percent 100 percent chance to get the pr because your work permit time will start instantly as a student visa you will waste three years then work permit will start as a skilled worker professional express entry pnp program you will consume 1.5 year in your home country by this way you will start exactly one to two month three month you will get job you will start your PR destiny automatically. Your tourist visa will change into the work permit and time of work permit consume more, the chance of the PR more. I will keep discussing these uh, topics, very sensitive topics more in the next clips. Thank you very much.